Hey guys, Wakerun Collapse back with the third and final box of my Japanese Black and White 9 Mega Low Cannon Booster Box opening. Uh, if you haven't seen Box 1 or uh, Box 2, definitely go back and check them out. There are some pretty uh, tremendous EX pulls and Hollow pulls and Ace Spec pulls. Um, and yes, I am going to spoil what happened in this, so uh, you have 5 seconds to shut it off if you don't want to know what happened in the, uh, the last two boxes. Alright, so uh, as anyone who has seen the last two boxes knows, I didn't pull any full arts or shinings in either of my previous two boxes. Now when I had my Spiral Force and Thunder Knuckle booster box openings, I didn't pull a full art in the first um, two boxes of that opening either. But I also finished with a shiny, so that would be really amazing to top it off and, uh, and buy back some of this luck with a shiny pull, that would be just stellar. But uh, really been kind of disappointed by my luck so far, but I also feel very fortunate to have gotten these boxes so early so that I was able to show you guys, um, you know, what kind of stuff is in these sets. So let's just jump into the final box and I'll let you know as I go uh, what cards I get that are new. So uh, Driftblim, Electric, uh, Golet, Larvesta, and Cradley. And hey, what do you know? Cradley finishing off the first pack of all three boxes. Like I said, it's Bear Tick all over again. This is actually kind of funny, I wanted to show you guys this. The three hollows I'm missing are Electros, Golurk, and Volcarona. Who says that the Pokemon Company doesn't have a sense of humor? <laughs> Hopefully I'm able to pull those. Um, the other two non, you know, secret rare or ultra rare cards that I'm missing are the uh, the G-Booster A-Spec and a regular Genesect EX. So, let's see what I can do to pull those. Alright, Silver Mirror, uh, Shelmet. Or Relicanth, another nice look at that card, excellent. Uh, Muna, and another Haxorus Hollow. So again, this is a duplicate, um, but it is an awesome duplicate as well. So I'm uh, I'm pleased to see it. So gotta love that Hollow pattern. Plus Haxorus is boss anyway. So uh, let's just set that down over here. Hopefully, um, some more of you guys have gotten your uh, Megalo Cannon booster boxes in by the time I upload this on Monday evening. So. Hoping to see uh, what you guys can pull. Love to see some uh, some awesome uh, some awesome cards. Uh, another Driftblim, Archon, uh, Carablast, Obama Snow, and three for three. This is my third Dialga EX. So um, if anyone has the uh, Genesect and I don't pull it from this box, I would be more than happy to trade a Dialga for it, or you know, what have you, whatever it is that you're interested in, I might uh, might have for you. Um, so we'll be looking to move two of these. Uh, I will be selling as well, but I haven't decided on a price. So um, if you are interested in buying, let me know and I will figure something out for you. But still, Diaga might be the most impressive looking regular EX in the set. So still happy to have some, uh, some extras of those to play with. And a little focus, here we go. Plasma Energy, Porygon, Duosion, uh, Teddy Ursa, and Escavalier. Oh, no spoilers there. Ah, uh, Caitlin. If uh, you've seen the first two boxes, you know my story with this girl. So, uh, Sock, Snover. Oh, spoilers. Uh, Laron, and there's the Volcarona Hollow. I thought I seen it there. Uh, let's get a little bit of focus action going on there. Come on. JJP does this, and it seems to work. Hey, and it worked. Wow, this is an awesome looking card. Having not seen it in person yet, it's just, it's really impressive, so. Excellent. Very, very happy to add this to my collection, so. Sweet, Volcarona. Uh, I did postulate in uh, one of the previous videos that I thought the A-Specs took the place of uh, EXs. Like, you would get four ultra-rare pulls, and uh, the, if you got a second A-Spec, it would replace an EX. So you could get, you know, two A-Specs and two EX cards in a box, or, you know, what have you. Maybe if you miss on the A specs, you get four EXs. We'll see. Uh, Masquerain, Lapras, uh, Solosis, Fracture, and Iris. Then I'll have to wait to see some other uh, some other booster box openings before I can uh, officially uh, reach a verdict on that one. But some of you guys might be onto that as well. Uh, Cover Fossil. I think I decided it was Cover Fossil in the last video. Uh, another nice Octillery. A uh, Houndour, 
a Remoraid, and a Reuniclus. I wonder if I'll pull my Ace spec out of this pack. They were tending to show up kind of early in the box, so... Maybe it'll be in this pack, or maybe, you know, maybe something nicer. Let's see. Alright, Glalie, uh, Tynamo, Drift, Loon, sorry, Throw, and there's another Ace spec card. Uh, this one, I think, is the G-Scope. So this is another duplicate, um, will be up for trade, or sale, if you're interested. Uh, this is the uh, tool that if you attach to uh, Genesec DX, uh, it gains an attack that allows you to, for, I believe, yep, it's two grass energy and one colorless energy, you can see it at the bottom, uh, deals 100 damage to one of the opponent's bench Pokemon, so. Uh, that could be useful, I think. I think we were talking about it on another video, maybe not mine, uh, that it would make a whole lot more sense if Tool Scrapper didn't get rid of the ace specs that you attach as tools. Just seems like um, it would make the game open up a lot more, you can make a lot, thing, a lot of things more playable. Uh, Iris, uh, Aeron, Axew, Surskit, nice, and there's the Go Lurk Hollow. It's really like a, a fearsome fearsome choice of art. It's just very intimidating. It makes it seem so much bigger than the card is. You can uh, get a nice good look at him there. That's really impressive, actually. This is one of my favorites out of this set, too. I mean, I've been a Golurk fan anyways, but this card in particular is just, uh, just really, really nice. So, Oh, I remember what opening it was on. Um, just to ramble while I'm opening this pack. Uh, this was on... Um, the Cat's Meowth channel. Uh, she had her boyfriend open uh, another booster box of Plasma Storm. I think that's where we were talking about it. Uh, Caracosta, Porygon 2, Musharna, Tortuga, and another Silver Mirror. Moving on through. Might get a little bit uh, antsy and start opening packs by hand. Hope you guys don't mind if I do switch it up like that. Alright, Excelgore. Uh, Lilip, Machop, Ursaring, and another Palkia EX. So that kind of stinks, so I'll probably not pull the Genesect EX, but I'm hoping for a full art later in the uh, later in the box. Dude, JJP, that actually works. <laughs> Anyways, um, nice, very cool. Um, glad to have another one of these to, uh, to mess around with. I think this is only my second, so I am, uh, I am fine with that. Really, really hoping that my final ultra rare pull of the uh, box is a full art or a shining. This would just be so disappointing if I don't pull a single one out of three boxes. Kind of crush the whole opening all by itself. Uh, Agron, uh, Golette, Dredagon, Tropius. Hey, sweet, and there's the Electros Hollow. Well, that makes me feel better. I don't have to buy any of the hollows. That's really cool, too. I don't know, are you guys a fan of uh, how they really increased the rainbow activity, especially in this uh, this newest set? I think they were kind of testing it out with a couple of the uh, the holographic images from uh, Spiral Force and Thunder Knuckle. Uh, the Reshiram Hollow, in fact, comes to mind in particular, so. Hey, that opened kind of nice. See what I mean? I just decided to switch like that. Um... Silver Bangle, that's what it's called. Uh, Electric, Machoke, Chatot, and Agron. Pause for a little bit of station identification while I pick up all this stuff. Yeah, I was just too excited when I walked in the door after work today. I uh, went on to my videos, uh, responded to all your wonderful comments on uh, Box 1, which as of right now is the only one that has been... Uh, has been uploaded. Um, just really impressive and very gracious turnout from all of you. Checking out my video, I always love that. Uh, Silver Bangle, Snow Runt, Larvesta, Fracture, awesome, and another Houndoom Hollow. I don't know if you saw the shadow of the fist bump there. Just really stoked to get another one of these. Excellent. If you can't tell, I'm a Houndoom fan, so. Getting extra ones of those, whether I sell them or trade them or not, is just awesome for me. Huh, these packs are actually opening really easy. Interesting. Maybe I'll switch to opening by hand from now on for the new packs. 
uh, Glalie, Shelmet, Laron, yep, Carablast, and this one was Root Fossil, I think. Oh, jack that one up a little bit, but oh well, I'll live. Is it time for the full art poll? Is it? Let's see. Masquerain, Relicanth, Porygon 2, uh, Archon, and a Verizion EX. So this is for the EX is an exact duplicate of the uh, of the first box, and I believe it is a full guarantee that out of my three boxes of Megalo Cannon, zero full arts and zero shinings. I hate to be that guy, but that really sucks. You know, I spent like almost 150 bucks on the three boxes, and it's not that I don't feel lucky to have gotten them early. I don't feel lucky to have gotten all these awesome EX cards, but as a full art collector in particular, just it stings the wallet, that's all. It's, uh, so we got Excelgor, Muna, Snover, Porygon, and uh, Yuxi. I think this is my first of the Lake Guardians in this, uh, in this box. I'm going to tore that pack a little bit. So hopefully there's another hollow to go in here. But again, like I've been saying, I'm not keeping count. Uh, Root Fossil, Akshu, oh, there we go. Uh, Duosion, Obama Snow, and another Mesprit Hollow. So that might do it for the box, I'm not sure. That's pretty nice. Sorry if I seem a little bit deflated, guys. I was just really looking forward to this opening, so. Alright, Caitlin. Tynamo, Teddy Ursa, Dredigon, and a Plume Fossil, I think. And the last pack of the last box of Megalo Cannon. Probably has nothing, but I want to open it anyways. Um, I think this is Reversal Trigger. Musharna, Artillery, Houndour, and the Uxie. I think I have to step away from uh, from Pokemon for a few days to kind of kind of focus on some other stuff. Maybe uh, get a little bit of distance, cool off from this. All right. Um, so, anyways, recap: uh, Mesprit, Verizion EX, uh, Houndoom, uh, Electros Hollow, which is new, uh, Palkia EX, Golark Hollow, was which is new, uh, A Spec G Scope for uh, Genesect, uh, Volcarona. Um, which is new as well. Uh, Dialga EX and Haxorus. So, sorry I couldn't pull anything good. Uh, actually quite disappointed about this. Um, but thank you very much guys for watching. I really appreciate all the, uh, the likes, the comments, and the subscriptions. It's just been, uh, it's been really amazing to see your show of support for me. I never really thought that I would have videos quite at that level, uh, of interest. So, um, Thanks again for watching. Make sure you sub if you haven't already, and I will be back in a little while. Hopefully, I'll be able to bring some good stuff to you guys. Peace.